And new here at noon, we do have an update for you on a hog super fan trying to make his way to the Sweet 16. All right, now you'll remember University of Arkansas sophomore Cole Phillips, who is blind, has been attending hog games for the past nine years. Now his dad always goes with him and provides play-by-play -play of these games. Now they started a GoFundMe to get enough money for the trip and those tickets. Yeah, and Fine News reporter Tiffany Lee is joining us in the studio now with an update on if they made it out to San Francisco, Tiffany. Yeah, guys, they made it. Thanks to people around the community, Cole and his dad, they are in San Francisco and they are ready to call those hogs Golden Gate style. Now, yesterday I had the chance to talk with them while they were traveling and hear just how sweet it is for them to have their sweet 16 dreams come true. I'm stoked. I'm ready to go to work as a fan. Cause as much uh, chaos as I can for, uh, for Gonzaga and all their players. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, and give as much energy as I can um, and, and, you know, make sure that I don't let the people that donated to me down. For the past nine years, University of Arkansas sophomore Cole Phillips has been attending hog games with his dad by his side. His dad acts as his own personal sports radio with play-by-plays each game. You know, anybody who has a child to see your uh, child that excited <laughs> and, and that enthused and, and happy is just a joyful moment for you. I think you I'm know? happy. And so... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think he's a little, it's a little more than that. A <laughs> the two loyal hog fans are beyond excited to attend the game today. Cole even got in a dance battle at the airport on the way. When Cole started a GoFundMe to raise the money for travel, he set the goal at $5,000, which was enough for him and his dad to get tickets and have a place to stay. Not only did they raise the money, they were given free tickets to the game and a free place to stay. And the father-son duo tells me that the hogs are going all the way. The money that they raised will now be for Elite Eight tickets all the way to the championship, giving the two memories to last a lifetime. I'm going to tell my grandchildren, especially when we win, uh, <laughs> and be able to get them, get to tell them about how, you know, people came together and were able to raise money for us to go and over in just, you know, under 24 hours. I'm going to try to reach out to everybody who donated as best I can uh, for those that weren't anonymous and, and give them you know, thank you notes and, and do everything I can. And you heard Colt say it. He said that he is going to work today because he doesn't want to let down the people who got him there. And he told me those dance moves, they were just practicing for that victory dance later tonight. For now, I'm Tiffany Lee covering news for you, Lit 5 News. Now, Cole and his dad were also invited to a pregame event today. That'll start in about two hours.